Hey guys, Grand Rising this morning. It's your girl Venetia. Um, how's everything going? Hope you guys are blessed and today's a productive day for you guys. So um, let's get into it. Um, today I want to talk about um, UTI, urinary tract infection, right? Most of us know what that is. We have experienced it maybe um, once in our lives or some for some it's reoccurring and stuff like that so um yeah hey guys so i want you know like like my stuff guys follow us on facebook like us on instagram um share or stuff if you if you think our content is um you know it's informative and it's valuable to someone share it um subscribe to our youtube channel like and share you know pass on the word you know the message but um yeah let's get into it guys um uti what is it urinary tract infection is an imbalance in the mucous membrane tissue that lines the urinary tract and allows for bacteria to adhere causing infection and discomfort right symptoms that you can um get with this is um imbalance in the urinary tract um you know cause you know you get painful urination um you know increase you, you know increased need to urinate you know you want to go to the bathroom more frequently and when you do go i mean it's when you do go you know it, it it seems like you have a lot to let out but when you say like a little bit because your bladder is um it's inflamed so it gives you that feeling um pressure in the pubic bone when urinating i guess what i just said so um often a dragging pain at the end of the urine stream so it you know you get that burning sensation you know once you're done you know you feel that pain so that's how you really know that something is going on down there um if you you know are having any of these symptoms guys um and and um my ladies everybody out there men get it also um if you guys are um experiencing any of these symptoms guys you know urinating you know it burns you know stuff like that that pressure you know in your pelvic area stuff like that please get evaluated by um your you know a medical professional um so that they could um diagnose you with this problem and you can you know get it treated if you want to go that way but there are also um you know herbs natural herbs that you know can support your urinary tract um, your urinary tract also, all right? But we'll get into that later. Um, what causes it? Um, urinary tract infection is usually caused by a yeast or a bacteria, right? Um, it's um, mostly caused by the presence of E. coli, um, approximately 80%, you know? And, um, and may also um, come from enterobacter staphylococcus and other bacteria the bacteria have mechanisms that allow that allows them to adhere to the lining of the bladder and the mucosal the mucosal wall of the arm um, the entire urinary tract causing inf inflammation um cloudy urine with an unpleasant odor and bladder and pelvic pain so if you're experiencing any, any of these problems guys as i said before please go and get evaluated by your medical professional or you know seek some professional sorry guys <laughs> seek some um professional help all right um being a woman <laughs> is one of the main you know it's the main thing for us because we're you know we're more prone to getting urinary tract infections because you know of how our body is set up um it says so women are more prone to uti because of the close proximity of the youth um your urethra your urethra your urethras and your anus right um the bacteria have a shorter distance to travel to travel in order to colonize um in the lining of the urethra of the bladder right hormonal changes during pregnancy change the tone of the kidneys so pressure is placed on the bladder from the growing uterus and may cause congestion in the bladder and inability to completely empty the bladder right so if you're you know if you're pregnant you know the, the, the change in your body can cause can cause you to get utis also all right so look out for that um um if you're um 
if you're over 65 and stuff um menopause you know you're going through menopause so estrogen and um progesterone shifts during menopause alters the ph of the urine and causes and cause changes in the tissue structure women over 65 are um have the highest rate of utis okay so you know be careful with that guys so just you know be more more eat more um garlic and stuff like that but i'll get into that later all right um um another thing um chemical factors guys can cause um utis um antibacterial soap sprays douches um feminine deodorants um contraceptives jellies and creams all alter normal ph of the urinary tract allowing environmental environment for allowing environment for bacteria to colonize in your urinary tract okay um antibiotics you um antibiotic use um depletes uses depletes the friendly bacteria normally presents in the gen the genit the, the geno the genito urinary tract <laughs> sorry and allows the overgrowth of candida which is yeast right um this can alter the ph of the urinary tract and continue and contribute to reoccurring um utis okay so be careful of that also stress can cause um utis guys um things that you can herbs um things that you can do to um minimize all of these guys things um herbs that you can um take stuff how to eat and stuff like that um herbs that and um help the urinary tract guys um you have antimicrobial herbs antimicrobial herbs inhibits microbials growth and expression um anti-inflammatory herbs reduces inflammation and local um local irritation in, in, in tissues astringent astringents um removes ex excess secretion from tissues giving a um, tonifying um effect uh diuretic supports the kidneys ability to secrete more fluid um, antispasmodic um, herbs release uncomfortable spasms in the bladder and ureters and ureters right herbs that you can take cinnamon coriander uva ursi um cranberry dandelion leaf echinacea fennel seeds garlic marshmallow root slippery elm, elm si slippery elm bark powder tongue tie um stinging nettle yarrow and if you're pregnant do not take yarrow um eat organic fruits and vegetables um cranberries blueberries lemons watermelons carrots celery fennel fennel onion parsnip um turnips eat pumpkin seeds um yogurt with active um bacteria cultures and you can take barley right um drink at least eight to ten glasses of water guys vegetable juice um herbal teas to help dilute and wash out bacteria um unsweetened cranberry and blueberry juice to prevent the bacteria from sticking to the bladder um the bladder walls onion and garlic which are um, antibacterial raw garlic is best guys um you can add it to everything eat, eat a peg of garlic every day and um you'll be fine because what it does it will help you to um minimize the antifungal and you know it's have antifungal prep back um properties antibacterial properties so if you eat garlic every day it will minimize the growth of the yeast and the candida and all that stuff the bacteria in your in your body okay um no meat guys alcohol sugars artificial food additives um which irritates the bladder um refined sugars um flour dairy products caffeine black or green tea chocolate sodas guys you know eliminate all of these things guys and as i said before just start taking care of yourself guys you know if you feel like you know something is wrong down there and you feel funny don't wait until the the problem progress before you go and get it checked out or go see a medical professional you know go now all right and if not then you know you you know it could cause other problems guys so you know and as i said you could eat garlic eat garlic every day eat onions you know you know just drink a lot of water keep your body hydrated flush detox cleanse your body guys um 
take your herbs and stuff you know all of these things guys can help your body maintain a healthy balance guys um drink sea moss daily you know to help put back your you know your minerals your, your calcium your potassium your your magnesium your you know your your, your your chlorides and your sodium and all of that stuff guys so you know do all of these things to help maintain your body and if you're in need of our services give us a call at 954-507-7481 ask for your girl venicia all right bye guys